Hello everyone, a very big welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a swimwear haul. Hallelujah, the summer is here. I'm one of those awful people who have way too much swimwear. Like, I have one body, the UK never has heat, and I go on one, maybe two holidays abroad a year. Why do I need so many swimwear items? I don't know, you tell me, because I'm still working out the answer. In this video, I'm going to show you some things that I got from an online store called Zaffle. I'm really hoping I said that right. They don't only do swimwear stuff, but I decided to do just a swimwear haul using their items. Also, a lot of you say to me that you want me to make a body confidence video, and especially with spring, summer coming, everyone's thinking about their body a bit more, I think. I think. I have actually already made a video on body confidence and how you can feel better about yourself. I actually literally put every tip I have and have ever had in that video. I made it last year so I'll leave a link to that down there. Go click it if that sounds like it would interest you. But now let's go straight into what I got. Firstly I actually got these sunglasses that are on my head. Oh they keep getting stuck to my hair. All sunglasses do that to me. I am so in love with them. Look how nice they are. I've got ones very similar to this, but in pink, but I'm just loving the blue, especially with my blue hair. Um, it makes everything so dark, like so, so dark. But no, that's the first thing I got, uh, and I really love them, no flaws whatsoever, and I feel like they jazz up an outfit. They also look really cool for like festivals and stuff, I feel like it brings a bit of pizzazz. So I don't really know where to start. I've got a lot to get through. I'm probably gonna start off with my favorite one, this, um, aerial themed is this aerial bikini and it's got like the shell kind of top and the scale mermaidy scale bottoms i'm so in love with this a little thing i would like to say though is that this is a size xl and i believe their sizes i want to say is like two sizes out so i think to be safe, if you are somebody like me who is very curvy and has some lumps and bumps and isn't particularly too confident, like if you got something that was very tight, you would be pretty disappointed, then I'd recommend you go up like two. Because if I had got just like a large, which I probably would have for this, their sizing is very off and this is an XL. And to me, this is just, it's not an XL for high waisted. I don't think like an XL person would not fit into this, but regardless bloody love this so this is my favorite thing out of all of them the second favorite i got was this it's a similar sort of theme sticking to the mermaid life because why not this is also an xl this is just a like what you think is a normal swimsuit but it's this like sky blue sort of watery cloud effect i don't know how to explain this but on the front here it says mermaid off duty and i just think that's really nice it's a really nice touch like it looks kind of basic but I love that little touch and I love how, I just feel like that would make a lot of people smile if they saw someone wearing that. The back is also really interesting. It goes pretty low down and I quite like that because it makes it a tiny bit different. The thing I like most about this is that it's pretty simple, but then it has a fun little twist to it. So those are my two favorites out of everything. So I thought I'd get those done with first. This next one is a little bit more subtle in comparison to that last couple. It's so beautiful though. Um, this is, by the way, everything I got was off really good quality. I'm really happy because swimwear can be a little bit dodgy. I don't want anything see-through, obviously. I don't want anything feeling like it's going to rip or something because if it gets chlorine in it and stuff and you've got to wash swim costumes and look after them properly if you're like swimming about in them and stuff, obviously. So you want you want to get high quality things because you're naked under these and I don't want to be naked in public, funnily enough. This is really gorgeous. It's a halter neck. Um, and oh, it's beautiful because I don't really like bikinis. I'm not too confident with my stomach like I've been telling you But this still shows some skin But it, it doesn't at the same time because you're covered It just gives you that illusion that you're wearing sort of the same as everyone else's even though not everyone wears bikinis But do you know what I'm saying here? Like it shows but it doesn't at the same time and I live for some reason the um, they sort of look wooden, but they're not. These little buttons on either side uh, of the of the bottoms. Just the, the, the whole design of this and the thickness as well, because this feels very fitting. This is probably one of the most fitting things I got and it just snugs you in and obviously black it slims you too. And the top, the, the, key, the top part is padded. The only worry I do have with this mermaid off duty sh um, cosy 
is that even though it is double double um, protected, double protected, it doesn't kind of keep me together like everything else and I've got those boobs that kind of have a mind of their own and also my nips could come through so this doesn't hold me in as well as the others so I don't feel as confident in this one. That's just my own preference. <laughs> this is another really fun one. I have another cozy like this, but it's it's like a different tropical fruit, but this is just pineapples. What I really like about this is, I mean, it's got, it's got pineapples on it. I mean, what else? Do you need another reason why I like this? No, you don't. But I like how at the back here, so it's a halter neck and at the back, You've got just this little strap here. I just like anything with a tiny bit of uniqueness. And then there's like no back bit. This padding at the bra is good because like, like I say, I like a bit of padding on my boobs. And it's really colourful and bright and it goes quite well with blue hair. Um, I just like the orange colours and the greens. Ready for some pineapple cocktails. Does anyone remember that lady who wore the red swimming cozy in the Kellogg's advert, the cereal? This one really reminds me of that. It's really gorgeous actually. Uh, it's so simple, but it's not because I don't like too simple. This is sort of interesting because it's got this like jagged edge um and it just looks it just looks so cute and actually i may consider like wearing the top part of that with like a skirt or something if i'm on a walkabout or, or something like around the holiday resort or whatever because it just looks nice as like a top um but obviously it's for swimming or like sunbathing or whatever and it's this v shape so the back's pretty low down too and it's that's it basically it's fairly simple the material is quite interesting as well it's like this very thick this is quite a thick one which is a good thing <laughs> again I like to be sucked in I I usually have red hair so this probably won't look best of red uh, on my head I feel like red in swimwear is like so cute and just striking and bold and makes you feel pretty sexy maybe that's just me um yeah i've got so many swim costumes <laughs> i don't even know what i'm gonna do with all these wear them like a different one every day this one's really interesting um because it's got that bikini top but it's still a swimming cozy i just prefer swimming cozies as you can tell so it has this little gap here in the middle which i kind of like it gives it a nice little touch i mainly got this actually for the kind of shell like bra where it looks sort of like you've got a shell bra. I'm just, I just really appreciate a shell bra. It's a halter neck, so it goes obviously around your neck, um, and it's also the same sort of like thickness, that thick material that was in the red one. So this is also really fitting. So happy with that. And then um, the back clips on with some metal, um, which is really good. Like I like the fact that it's metal because it means it's more secure. But it's making me wonder whether that's going to get hot don't know why they'd have a metal conductor for a swimming cozy because that's gonna burn in the sun. Other than that, love it. <laughs> this one's a really interesting one. I was a bit skeptical about this, but I think I could rock it. So this is interesting because it's this sort of like fake jean look. It sort of reminds me of jeggings. It's supposed to look like high-waisted high-waisted jean shorts, I suppose. I got this also in a XL, by the way, and I'm glad I did because I just, I feel like I can, I just am the right size for this to go with this polka dot top. I love how this, I, oh my gosh, this is gonna look really nice. Actually, I feel like this might look quite nice with my blue hair. I love how I've never had a polka dot. Polka dot bikini girl. Here's what I'm gonna do. Take out that polka dot bikini girl. Yeah, I just really liked how this looked with the jean together. It just gave off this really nice vibe. Um, I'm trying to think of what the vibe is that I'm thinking of right now, but I know it looks nice, so. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Let me know what you think of of this one in particular. I'm interested because it's quite different. Um, there's another little metal detailing button here. This I got 
for a like cover up kind of thing. I'm a big fan of cover ups. Uh, I feel like if you're out in the sun, you don't want to get changed when you're in your costume too much. If you want to just quickly go to the pool bar or like walk around or something, but still be like nice and breezy, um, you can always pop on cover ups or like komodos or something over what you're already wearing. So this was a really nice um, cover up. <laughs> I keep using the word cover up. I think it just gives these really nice bohemian vibes, sorta. I just like the, I mainly like the feathers actually against the the white, um, what's this made of? I'm so bad at guessing what material is made of. Is anyone else like really bad at that? I don't know. Whenever I've been on holiday and like I'm about to leave the beach or the pool or whatever, I'm in my swim costume. I really appreciate the fact that I've bought cover-ups with me because then I can just like pop this on and start going for a walk somewhere um, and it gives you a bit more dignity and you still feel fabulous and lush in it. That is actually all of my swimwear stuff. However, I've got two, um, what are these even called? I don't know what these are called, but they're like, I wanna say beach mats. And I'm not gonna be able to show you this <laughs> on screen. You can have a look at the cutaway. They had a few of these on their site. Like the reason why I love this is because I don't even have to use this in like, abroad i don't need to use this in the sun i can use this as a picnic blanket i can use this which by the way i bloody will i have way more picnics than i do relaxing in the sunshine because i live in the uk <laughs> you can use this to cover up like chairs you can use it as what, what you, like a chair throw um you can use this to cut to go over your beach bed your beach chair you can put this on the floor like on the beach to like protect you from the sand like this can be used for so many different things and that is why i love it so the first one i got is a massive yin yang sign with some black tassels that go all the way around it it's just a massive yin yang i can't even show you how big this is that is how big it is like you can only see one little dot it can fit like three people on this two if they're lying down or one if you want to use the other one and give this to your friend, because I got two. They basically have designs, like the designs I liked most out of all the different, um, what are they called, like mats, were the ones that were like focused on the round design. So I liked the fact the yin yang was in a round pattern. This also is a watermelon, which is also a round pattern. This is such a cute one. It's basically like the in the guts of a, marsh of a marshmallow. <laughs> of a watermelon um it's such a pretty design i love the green and the pink anyway and oh so also i like the fact this is like a bit more girly and that black one i could give to adam when we go on holiday because i'm hoping we go on holiday this year so i just like the fact that that one's a bit more unisex i mean this is too like it's a bit of pink don't cry about it but what i'm saying is like I don't know whether he would have a watermelon one, so at least he can use that and I can use this. Or oh, I just use them both, I don't really care. Um, I love these, I'm obsessed with these. I'm just like, let me know some cool ideas I could do, I could use this for. Anyway guys, that is it. Those are all the things I got. Let me know what one was your favorite. What do you like wearing? And what would you consider wearing? Like, do you have a go-to swimwear? Cause mine's always either tankinis, or full piece suits or high waisted. I'm just very weird about bikinis. I do feel like I'm on the beach in my underwear if I wear a bikini. Do any of you agree with that or <laughs> just me over here with my five year old swimwear? Anyway, thank you very much guys for watching. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already to be notified every time I make a brand new video. I'm on social media such as Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. I also stream live on you now. All of those links are down there. I love you so much. Stay tuned. Bye guys. Mwah.